I, uh, I was inspired by the dancing satyr and uh, wrote a couple um, haiku about him. The first one is called Lacunae. There's a hole present there in your noggin, satyr, and in my verse. <laughs> Lacoon apprises where to connest, satire, et in poesy. The second one, entitled Tough Work. Verses from a brain, bodies from a shipwreck. Comparable tasks? Where's this cerebro? Corpora naufragio? I qual a pensum. And I wrote an epigram that I think most of you have heard me complain about. It took three days plus. I have been struck as so often about, you know, you look in the distance and you see ruins and buildings crumbling. And there's a kind of romance about them and they're kind of attractive, but they're also very sad. But also here at Fontana Salsa, on that first night when we took the tour, we learned about this olive tree that had lasted 800 years. So I, I wanted to just oppose these things and I've written an epicran called Monuments. Consider these ruins eroded by time. The disregarded constructions of men fall. Lo, the naughty olive. How tenaciously it survives the ages. Pliantly, the monuments of nature last a long time. Temper contritis has contemplare ruinas, ai difficat dominum post habitura cadunt. En no dos atenex quam saecula, saeculo liva perenat, naturae lente, du monumenta monent. <laughs> 